Yeah, good morning. You are welcome to this edition of video series concerning the coin farm. This morning, I want to show you how you can do a withdrawal from your coin farm account. So, here we are looking at the 50 most recent withdrawals. People are saying coin farm is a scam and the withdrawals here are fake and they are bots that are doing the withdrawals. But I want to show you so that you can see the interface and then when we finish the withdrawal, we can come and verify and see whether it is legit and it is authentic. So you can look at it and then you see this is the most recent 3.96 USD and then you have 1.00 USD, 2.77 USD like that and it continues. So these are the usernames of the people who withdrew these amounts. And then these are the wallets, the electronic wallets they withdrew into. So you can see all of them are pay here. All right. So we are going to do a withdrawal, a live withdrawal. So when you come here, you see your account for replenishing. That is where you used to buy new beds. So you come to the farm here and then you can buy your beds. And then this is the wallet you can withdraw from. So here you can withdraw the earnings that you have here into your electronic wallet. So let me show you my electronic wallet we are going to withdraw into. So here is this. So you can see here, let's look at all of them. So you have both the fiat and then the cryptocurrencies. So the fiat has to do with physical currencies of states. So here is the US dollar. Russian rubble and then the euro and then you have Bitcoin, Ethereum, Bitcoin Cash and then you have Litecoin, you have Dash, you have USDT. So you can choose to just look at the fiat or just the cryptocurrency. So let's go here. Now look at my balance is 0 0.18. 0 0.18. So that is what we have there. When we finish the withdrawal, we'll see whether the balance here is going to change. So take note of the balance we have on the account, which is 0 0.18. So let's go back to the coin farm. So take note of my username, if it's J Kenny. When we finish the withdrawal, we'll see whether it will appear here. And then that will tell us that these are live withdrawal accounts. Okay, so you go to withdraw funds you click on withdraw funds and then it brings you to this page where you see the various electronic wallets you can withdraw into so perfect money advanced cash bitcoin paypal and then the pay visa mastercard etc so here is the one we are using we are using this one because it is the one that has the lowest payout threshold each of the payment platforms have different minimum withdrawal amounts. The one with the lowest, as you can see, the 3.99 can give you 0.04 if you want to test it. So you saw that our balance on the account was 0.18. So these are three withdrawals that amounted to that amount. So you see the first withdrawal I did was 0.04. That was when I was testing the system so you could see it there. And then the second one was 0 0.10 and then the third one was 0 0.04 again and when you put them together you see that 0 0.04 plus 0 0.04 is 0 0.8 plus 0 0.1 that is what gives us the 0 0.18 so these are successful previous withdrawals and that is what we have in the wallet there all right so here we are going to input the amount we want to withdraw so I want to withdraw 8,290 silver coins and that will give me 1.22 USD. So when I withdraw this from here, I'm going to get $1.22. So this is my wallet ID and then you click on order payoff. And then let's wait for it as it loads. The internet is a little slow, so okay. So it is done. You can see it there successful. 
So look at the date is today's the 15th of July 2009. You can see the receiving amount which has been withdrawn, which is 1.22. Okay, so take note of the username here again, FaceJ Kenny. Let's go verify here and see whether it will appear there as a withdrawal. So there you see it. Fitz J. Kenny 1.22 USD. It means immediately I finish somebody has done withdrawal already. So that is a live withdrawal. Let's go and see the wallet and see whether it has appeared there. So let us refresh and then here it will take a few moments and then it will appear. Let's keep refreshing and see. It will come. All right, so we'll come back in two minutes and check it. Let's refresh here and see again. All right, so you see the number of withdrawals that are following my withdrawal. It is moving down. The same amount is there. And after some minutes, this one should be updated. Sometimes it takes a few minutes for it to be updated. But it will definitely be updated. All right, so let's wait for a minute or two for it to update our account at so we have other stuff here you can move the money transfer internal transfer you can do exchange you can trade your different currencies etc so this is the dashboard and then let's keep trying All right, so we'll come back and look at it. So that is how you do a withdrawal from your account. Let's refresh here again and see. So you see more people are still withdrawing, etc. Sometimes it takes about five minutes, 10 minutes for the account to be updated, but it will surely be updated. All right, so I'll come and show you the balance in the next video and then you will see it. Thanks for watching. See you again in the next video.